am so calm this morning. I know that with total confidence that I'm walking into God's plan for my future. I know that I'm marrying the man that was made for me. You are gentle, kind-hearted, patient, strong, and a man of integrity. You always put me first. I can't imagine not having you in my happiest moments, my anxious moments, and on the hardest days. Every day of my life is better with you in it. Thank you for accepting me for who I am and as I am. You show me the grace of Christ daily. I promise to always stand by your side, to respect you, to love you, and to seek you, to honor you, to lift you up, and to be your best friend. of you who don't know us, I'm Allie's sister, Sarah. I'm the baby. I'm Kayla. I would like to thank Byron's family for welcoming our side with open arms, and I would like to thank our family for being on time. <laughs> thank you, Mom and Dad. You made this happen today. It's such a big deal for our family, and it just was so perfect. Dear friends, we are assembled here today in the presence of God to unite Byron and Allie in marriage. The Bible teaches us that marriage is to be a permanent relationship of one man and one woman, freely and totally committed to each other as companions for life. Our Lord declared that a man shall leave his father and mother and unite with his wife in the building of a home, and that the two shall become one flesh. start out with saying that my sister is somewhat of a superhero. She's always on time or early, but mostly early. She eats healthy. She got a full ride to college. She got a career in educating the young children of America. She got the principal's award in high school. She has perfect handwriting slash cursive. She never needs makeup. I'd like to thank her for setting the bar real high and let me be the black sheep of the family for the past 25 years. imagined a more beautiful setting for this beautiful occasion. Oftentimes there's a deep sigh of relief. We've made it. We've made it to this point in time, right? It's, it's like the end of a long journey to get here, isn't it? And it is the end of a long journey. It's the beginning end of a long journey for you. A journey into oneness. Our prayer that it will be a journey that will celebrate togetherness and will celebrate God's presence in your life and in your marriage. Honestly, you've taught us everything and now you're teaching us how to live a fulfilled life with a perfect husband. You have a perfect house on the beach with a perfect puppy, like the most perfect dog on the planet. You've been our idol for 24 years, whether you've known it or not. You've taught us respect, how to be gracious, how to be smart, and how to be independent. I wouldn't be me without you. 
But even though it was tough, and it's still tough at times, you'll always be my big sister, and will always be your biggest fan. You look so beautiful today, and I'm so proud of you and Byron. We love you, and I love the couple you become. Allie, it's finally here. I woke up knowing today will be the best day of my life. And I know that because I know that today is the beginning of waking up next to you every day for the rest of my life. I could not be more proud of the woman that is going to be the mother of my children. You are strong, kind, brilliant, beautiful, thoughtful, passionate, and perfect. And I truly do consider myself to be the luckiest guy in the world. You bring out the best in me each day. You challenge me to grow and be a better version of myself. I hope that never stops. It gives my heart such peace knowing that Christ will be the foundation in our marriage and in time of our family. I will work to be the kind of man that God calls me to be and stand up and protect our family, and I will be the spiritual leader of our household. I am so excited that we are going to share our lives together. You are my companion, my best friend, my person, but you're also my lover, and I promise to never stop dating you. I hope I can always make you feel beautiful. I love you with all my heart, and I am so thankful that you chose me. And now you brought us the perfect husband, brother-in-law, and son-in-law. Byron's just another casual superhero. Besides looking like Prince Charming, he's patient and so kind. He's cool and casual, and he can still party like a rat boy. Ladies and gentlemen, I am pleased to present to you Mr. and Mrs. Byron Smythe.